Hey everybody, so I was actually just getting ready to do something. I thought, you know what, maybe I should make this an episode. I wasn't planning on it, but I am getting ready to travel and I just bought a brand new hard case to um, house my SMG 45 as well as as many other pistols as I can possibly fit in it because I just like to have as many guns in one case as I can. So try and limit the luggage a little bit. So I'm gonna just uh, see if I can prop up the camera better so you can see what I'm doing and eh, we'll just try this little impromptu thing. Maybe maybe someone will enjoy it, who knows. But stay watching and we're gonna get this baby cut out. Hey everybody, well, I'm uh, barely hanging on on the edge of your screen here, but it was honestly the best I could do. Actually, you know what, I just realized I think my stand goes up even farther. Well, give me a moment, we'll test that in a second. But in the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and I laid them out kind of how I want to have them. I have a couple things. Now, there are these little squares that you pull out individually, but sometimes it's just honestly easier to grab a knife, especially if you are in going to be in between squares and you want like a perfect fit. Um, but so far, what I have in here at least is I have the SMG 45. I have two of the magazines that would go with it. I have a pistol here. Um, I have another one on the other side that I'm going to cut out. And then I'm like, I'm doing the math here. I definitely can get one here. I, I could probably get a second one there. And then maybe it's the same thing on this side. I could probably get two. Um, and then I'm thinking possibly putting mags, like mag holsters up through the top. And potentially down right here in some of the other areas. So uh, I also brought a little pen, which I will generally, I'm going to start by, I just kind of make little marks with it. Um, it doesn't, I don't necessarily always want everything to be like, you want it to be snug, but not, you know, doesn't need to be exactly precise, but it, considering it does have the top that will still hold it together. But I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna turn off the camera and draw around all of these guns and things that I have and make my um, template. And then I'm gonna try and prompt the, prop the camera up a little bit higher so you can see what I do. And we'll keep going from here. Okay, so I see that uh, you probably can't see my pen on here because I realized I can see it perfectly well not perfectly but I can see it but it was a, I did a gold color um and I realized you guys probably can't see it so I'm gonna go ahead and just cut it out and then we will fine tune it because I made like rough outlines so hopefully I just didn't screw it up to be quite honest with you I this is the first time I've had this kind of case other ones have had like it was kind of already set up for that type of weapon so you may have had to do a little adjustments but not like start from scratch so this might be the worst video I've ever made if I really screw this up but <laughs> one way or another you're gonna see the result so I'm gonna go for it and I'll be back in a second hopefully I'm not crying on the next side <laughs> okay so I just finished cutting it out I didn't screw it up as it turns out I realized an important lesson in that I I apparently can't cut a straight line so it does it did kind of look like a. well I'll just show you yeah it 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 honestly kind of looks like a third grader was was given safety scissors for the first time and unsupervised but you know It still fits, so <laughs> I guess that's all that matters. I'm going to keep cutting. I'm going to add more pistols and potentially some mag. I was just kind of, um, I was kind of debating on how I wanted to lay this out, but uh, so far, so far so good, even though I can't cut worth of crap, but that's fine. I did it. <laughs> I did it well enough that we haven't screwed anything up this far. I make no promises going forward, but we're going to continue anyways. Well, I am back and I got it all cut out for four pistols, my um, SMG 45 and two magazines. I may go ahead and add some magazine 
um, another magazine section up here since I have a little bit of free space, but I'm still debating on that. But honestly, I'm pretty impressed with myself. Um, I didn't screw it up. So if I can do it, you can do it. That's my point. And here we have it. As you can see, I just picked uh, four different pistols, relatively the same size. Um, obviously, if any of my pistols have optics on them, that's gonna that's gonna put a damper on it. I mean, it cut out a little uh, section in there for the optic to be able to fit, but or I could just bring pistols without optics. So, hope you like my video. I wasn't expecting to even make this, but here we are. And uh, hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you on the next video. I'm getting ready to travel, so it may take me a little bit to put together some content there, but I will definitely be making it while I'm out there, as well as training. So I will definitely be getting range footage and a lot more, a lot more stuff to come. Have a great day.